was very much involved. And of course, uh, back in the day, you know, we'd all go back to home. Yeah. Uh, but he went back to home and did a lot of things. He he had this concept of, of uh, sports city in Puerto Rico that he initiated and championed uh, that uh, uh, didn't really turn out after his demise as he wished. But he was a big factor in that. The time, really what prompted his trip the, the night he died was the fact that he had gone to Nicaragua uh, to do some clinics and, and uh, they had been ravaged by an earthquake. And he got the word that the p relief supplies weren't really getting applied to where they should have been. And that prompted the, the, the uh, fateful uh, plane ride that killed him later on. So yeah, he was aware uh, of, of what he could do. And, and uh, he always said, if you can't do something for other people as a man, what is your purpose on earth? You know, he had that quote uh, attributed to him. So he was consistent with it. He didn't just talk about it, but every year he'd go back there, put on clinics, uh, give money, uh, raise money. I sincerely believe, Chris, that had he lived, he would have been the governor of Puerto Rico. He had that much clout, that much intelligence.